Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. All right, so in honor of my glossy jet black hair that looks so beautiful, uh, we're gonna be looking at gloss black vinyl because everybody knows that when you have glossy black hair like this, you want your car to match your hair perfectly. Well, not all gloss black vinyls are created equal. Uh, so we're gonna look at which one is the glossiest of all the black vinyls that you can buy. All right, so in order to do that, we have the Lantec gloss meter right here. We have five different gloss black vinyls that are common that uh, you guys are probably going to use. They're some of the most common, commonly purchased gloss black vinyls on the market. So we have some Cheetah Wrap gloss black. We have some 3M1080 gloss black. We have some Vivid gloss black. We have some Oracle gloss black. And then we have Vivid's Ultra Gloss Black. So I'm gonna get all five of these set up and we're gonna measure exactly how glossy they are and find out once and for all which one is the shiniest. None of that, this one looks glossier than that one or that one looks glossier than this one, you know, did it look different lighting conditions? No, we're not gonna do that. We're gonna get scientific. We're gonna get the actual result right here. All right, we got small pieces of each one cut out here. Uh, some of them have a protective film and some of them don't. The Oracle does not have a protective film over it. The Vivid does have a protective film over it. The Vivid Ultra Gloss Premium Series has a protective film over it. Also with the backing uh, being of a higher quality, it's not paper. The 3M, they had it labeled wrong. It's actually the 2080 film, that's interesting. Has a protective covering. And the Cheetah Wrap also has a protective covering. So I'm gonna get these laid out and we'll start testing each one. All right, we've got everything set up. Got everything labeled here. I'll bring you in close in a second. We got the Oracle, the standard Vivid Gloss Black, the Cheetah Wrap, the 3M 2080, and the Vivid Ultra Gloss. Uh, I'm gonna peel off the protective layers on it right now. And then we're gonna calibrate the gloss meter and we're gonna check each one and we'll write down the gloss reading that we get on each one and compare them at the end. So I'm gonna bring you guys in and just let you see for yourself. The Oracle almost has a, I don't know, a grayish look to it. It's not the glossiest film I've ever seen. Um, then you go over to the Vivid, standard, pretty black, nice and glossy. You can really see the reflection of the light in it. Go over to the Cheetah, compare it to the Vivid. The Cheetah is a little bit less black, but also pretty consistent, looks really nice. So far the Vivid has the least amount of orange peeling, I'd say, um, the darkest black. Then you go over to the 3M2080, pretty comparable to say the, the cheetah then the ultra gloss by vivid has little to no orange peel at all in it and I'd say is probably the darkest black out of all of them that's probably the, the most pure looking black wrap I've seen in a while um, go down again here for you real quick see the oracle looks the worst um, These three are all pretty close. And then this one is, is super black. So let's, uh, let's test it out. All right, I'm gonna do this measurement all in one shot here. So you guys know that I'm not messing with anything here. And I did it on a table, not on, a not on part of the car, so that we have a nice flat surface to measure the gloss reading with. We'll get the most accurate reading possible. I'm going to measure them all and as I go along, I'm uh, gonna write down the gloss reading of each one on these pieces of tape and we can compare them at the end. So I'll power on the gloss meter and I'm going to hit calibrate. I'm gonna hold it down and it's calibrating. It's calibrated, 91.2 is what the known standard is on that calibration piece. So I'm gonna start out right here. The Oracle, set it down, 86.6. 
the standard vivid gloss black here and hold it down 98.3 the cheetah wraps set it down hold it on 91.8 the 3M2080, 91.0, and the Ultra Gloss Pivot, 98.8. Power this baby down. All right, so going in order from least glossy to most glossy, we have the Oracle, which came in at 86.6. Then came the 3M2080 film, which gave us a 91.0. Then the Cheetah at 91.8. Then we have the standard Vivid Gloss Black at 98.3. And then finally, the winner of the gloss test was the Vivid Ultra Gloss Series. And this stuff looks pretty darn good. I don't think anyone would argue which one is the glossiest just by looking at them. Um, one thing to note, is the 3M versus the Cheetah. The 3M has a lot more orange peel. Like look where the light's reflecting off between the two. It gets real orange peely when you get onto the 3M. The Cheetah is not so much. So they're also, you know, to take into consideration the difficulty of applying the films. Sure, the Vivids are the glossiest, but they are gonna be the most difficult to apply to a vehicle, especially to a beginner. Um, so keep that in mind. Uh, the Cheetah, it's probably one of the least expensive brands. It's getting up there now in price, pretty close to the Vivids, but it's a thinner material, so it's easier to apply. However, you're not gonna be able to stretch the Cheetah as much as you would a thicker film like the Vivid. The Vivid's gonna be able to stretch a lot more without changing the glossiness or the the color of the wrap. All right, let's see you here. All right, 105. Yeah, see, nothing really compares to the luscious hair that I have, but at least we know that we can get really close with the Vivid. Hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, hit the like, subscribe. Uh, we've got a lot more videos coming up. I'm actually working on some homemade carbon fiber parts right now. So if you wanna see that, hit the subscribe so you don't miss it, and we'll catch you later.